Yeah! Natasha, Tamara, Sarah. Natasha, Tamara, Sarah. That sounds like a... I don't know what that sounds like. Combined. <laughs> Power Punch. Flyman. Bell. Buick. Alpha Shepherd Wolf, Tom Brookins present, Daryl Cowan has my future look in there, the P Waters. Kiv03. Richard, not so small, Goliathan, Flack, G Wiz, Johnny, Graham, Big Tex, Calvin James, Jason, Andrew, Ramona, Dualcom, James Cooper. Robo6011 Logic Michael We're live Just barely Just barely Man Whew. <sighs> Mike Johnson Dragon Let me catch my breath here Peter Tina and Joe Rowe. All right, we're going to pause that. Just said, take a sip of my tasty beverage, man. I barely made it in time for the stream tonight, folks. That was close. That was close. The freeway was a nightmare. Night Shadow, how are you? Hubert? Whew. Multiple accidents out there. I was gonna say I thought my farm got broken or something with the you know because I was I was looking at these blocks like wait what what happened to my farm and yes incredible journey to get back here Raymond and Ashley Johnson Ty Tavares yeah there were uh there were I pat on the way home on the freeway I passed six separate accidents there were only police at one of those six they just simply weren't enough right there weren't enough police officers for all of the accidents happening so man what a uh what a journey back that was i just didn't think i was gonna make it now the missus wasn't home so i couldn't tell her hey can you postpone the stream to a later time Oh, man. I'm going to take this and smelt it down somewhere with some brass or some clay. Might as well do it in this one right here. And we're going to make some jars out of that. Russell Nash. Nah, we don't have snow here, Peter. No, it was uh, it was 80 degrees outside today, sir. It's kind of like t-shirt weather here. That's what it was here, sir. <laughs> yeah, we don't get that. We get that about once every 20 years. And that's it. Are these cobble? These are concrete. Doggone it. I need cobblestone blocks. I bet you we can't even make any cobblestone. More cobblestone. Oh, there's cobblestone cubes. All right. All right. We got it. We got it. We all right. We all right. I'm all freaking out over here. Right. Yeah, 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 just you know, people traveling for the holidays and uh, is what it is. And uh, boy, Southbound was just incredible today. Uh, they had a four car accident with fatalities uh, this morning on my way out. And um, that was on the opposite side of the direction I was going. Uh, but it was uh, backed up for like 30 miles because they had to shut the freeway down. It went all the way into the next state over the uh backed up freeway and um you know so it was, it's been crazy all day just you know so many people out there so many people um i could almost put bars in right there you know what i mean i could have put bars in right there and just had a perfect square all the way around i wonder what that would look like if i did that let's do this and see i hope it doesn't all fall down if it does oh well uh, bar, uh, copy, oh my goodness, yeah, that doesn't look great because it's a different, it's turned differently than the other ones, you know what I mean, 6011, do I have a knife to replace my shiv, uh, I might be able to make one, maybe, 
I don't know. But we really got to think about that because uh, all of this doesn't matter up here anyway. What I want to do, what I want to do is make a way to get down that I don't have to go out these doors. Because these doors are going to lead to a different area, right? Uh, my horde base is going to sit right there, okay? So we're going to have platforms coming out of here and going over there. Aaron Dill, what's up? Um... Disclaimer to the effect of no show in 30 minutes, no stream. Nah, there'll always be a stream, man, unless unless something tragic happens, right? That's the one thing I pride myself in is that if I schedule a stream, I probably only missed. I could count on both my hands the streams I've had to miss in the past five or six years, right? If I got it scheduled, it's going to happen, right? It's very, very rare. That uh, I couldn't, you know, be here for the stream. I've missed so many things in my life, but I've been here because of that. I've, 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 you know, been here for the uh, for the streams, but I've had to sacrifice some things to to do that. Can I make a hunting knife? Now, nah, worst case scenario, forged iron, duct tape, leather, duct tape, leather. And I got forged steel. Man, I'm brains just thousand miles a minute here. I trying to trying to kick back here a little bit and relax. It's it's off. It's kind of awkward because usually I get home in time. Uh, what's up, Lay? Mungo Milton and Tamara from Austria. Oh, isn't that where Arnold Schwarzenegger's from? Isn't he from Austria? Arnold, Arnold from from Austria. I don't know. I'm just making that up. Maybe. I don't know. Is an Arnold Schwarzenegger from there? I think he got canceled this year. <laughs> Along with everyone else. Oh, man. Yeah. Yeah. He said some things he shouldn't have said. And it was just... <laughs> Goodbye. Just... Well, you know what? Instead of taking around this M60 day to day, can I make the X? It, I can make it. All right, forged iron, glue, mechanical spring. Forged iron, glue, mechanical spring. I need to make that extended mod for this nine millimeter, and then I don't have to take it off. I got no food, do I? I have no food. I don't even have a, a campfire over at this base. All right, let's stick all this stuff back. Here we go. Uh, East Bay Jordan. Yeah. No, no. I Okay, so, Russell, thank you for asking and reminding me because I would not have remembered. I will be streaming tomorrow, and I should be streaming on Christmas Eve for a little while, right? I uh, got it worked out with the Mrs. Um... It, it's just going to work out perfectly so that I don't, uh, I'm, I'm going to be able to be here for a couple, two, three hours for, oh, it takes two potatoes. I only have one for, uh, you know, Christmas Eve. And uh, I'm sure a lot of you probably be out, got stuff going on and, and that's cool and all. But I, I just, you know, I said, I'm going to try my best to do it. And the way it works out with the Mrs. and what she's got going on and everything, we won't be able to do our thing until later in the evening. So uh, I'll definitely be uh, be around. You know, the other problem is, is I don't. Oh, I do have some murky water because I just I'm just going to boil some meat. Right. That's all I got. Christopher Lee, boil some meat. I can do charred meat, char charred. Let's do uh, let's do 10 of these. And that takes a minute. That'll give me some uh, boiled meat. Let's just leave the meat sitting up in there. Let's take this, put it back in here, um, modify, just uh, take that off. I got this little mod right here. I can stick it on my thing. Let's see what I have in here. I got coffee. I got the sniper rifle for Horde Knight. That's what we're going to use for Horde Knight. Um, guess you could stick this retracting stock on there too, right? Maybe even a two-time scope on the sniper rifle. Does that have one? Oh, it's got the eight-time. Ugh. 
I don't really like that. We also have a 44 uh, caliper weapon that I could use. Wait, did I, did I just make one of those that I already had two? Wait, what? Where did I get an extra one of those things from? Doesn't matter. I'll stick it on everything. All right, we need one on there. Um, we need one on here. Modify, put that on. That's fully modded. Booger lady. Booger lady dead. Look at that right there. Look at that booger lady all sprawled out. I need to close my doors just in case one's go over there and looks up and sees me. Oh boy. I really are we are we already starting with that? Lawson. Shame on you, Lawson. What's up, Hill Rider? And Stravenstein. Okay, this is done. Boiled meat. Boiled meat. Ten. All right, let's get back up in here. Let's get... Uh, whoa! What kind of bug is that? I placed the campfire. It's still on my belt. Look at that. You see that? Campfire. But I just stuck one there. It didn't go away. Well, that's odd. Ugh, I don't like that. Um, what does it look like if I zoom in with this SMG and fire some rounds? Guess that would be okay with a two-time scope. I don't really like having a scope on weapons, but, you know, it is what it is. Alright, let's put this stuff away for Horde Knight. I gotta get some uh, 9 millimeter ammo out. Gotta do that. Stick this on there. I can stick that on there. All right. So this is good for Horde Knight. This is good for Horde Knight. And this is definitely good for Horde Knight right here. Can't go without that. Uh, do a sort. And that just goofed it all up, didn't it? There. There. 51.8. Wait, this is actually lower. 48. So we need to modify this one and sell the other one. Glad I looked at that, because that's a few points of damage. Not that a few points really going to matter in the scheme of things, but, yeah. Keep the better un. Uh, we'll just put this one away to sell. Uh, this is a stable version. B238 is stable version. All right, there's the boiled meat I needed to eat. Let's drink one of these, and let's eat all four of these. Eagle Rider, what's up? Thank you, Eagle Rider. Creative mode. No, no. This is Survival Series LH. Uh, Lipas? Okay, here we go. Here we go. Put that there. Here, gonna eat another one of those. Well, that'll get the hunger up a little bit. It ain't great, but it's it's better than nothing. Oh, Alexandria, what's up? We are in desperate need of resources. It's day 28. Today is horde day. Um uh, trying to make my mind up if I want to build or just go gather some resources. And I think. I just need to go gather resources and go get my ammo from the other base. I didn't bring it for my uh, the gun I'm currently wielding. I think I'm going to need it for that. And we can put this ammo in here until the horde arrives. And I can throw... Oh, I need the wrong one. Throw that bone shiv out. Let's uh, let's hop on our, our thing and uh, shoot over to the other base real quick and scoop that up. Make sure it's full of gas. I am going to mark where I need to go. It's right there. I probably didn't even need to do that. It's all right. It's marked now. Up, up, and away we go. Yeah, I need iron. I need clay. I need stone. And I need for my phone to stop ringing. Why is my phone ringing? Well, I don't even know what I'm doing here. Well, that was strange. It rang. 
but there's no one there. Like, no number came up or anything. I can't see if I'm going up or down or all around or whatever. I don't know. It's so dark. So I'm at 94% CPU on my capture computer over there right now. So this darkness is awful for that. No, I got that last night, Pale Rider. Thank you. Um. Oh, I can see here. I can see stuff. Wait, I'm not going down, am I? I think I am. Better pick that back up, Chris Small. <laughs> oh, man. So you had asked if it's worth it living in the wasteland. Unless you want to commute back and forth every day to do your quest and to loot the good loot. I mean, I just moved there, right? It's, it's going to be no picnic. You're not going to have fun at first, but once you get established, it shouldn't be that bad. But you're going to have to do what I did probably and set yourself up some defenses around your crafting base so that the screamers can't scream. And if you play with feral sense on like I do, they're just going to constantly bombard you, right? So you got to keep that in mind, too. Oh, we made it to the forest. CPU should uh, free up now. Maybe that's what it was. My car warranty expired, Christopher Lee, even though it's still good for a couple of years. Oh, they left a uh, voicemail even. Well, that's strange. I'm looking at my... I have my phone in my hand right now. Oh, I see who it was. Okay. It was one of those automated calls. I got to get myself off that call list. Three MZs took out some of the stairs. So what I didn't really explain, Jeffrey, is when you put those stairs up, put plates on the side of those stair blocks and upgrade those to steel and upgrade the stairs to steel. And the worst they might do is break the plates that are attached, uh, you know, to the, the side of the blocks that make the stairs. I actually, someone said that it didn't work anymore or something. So last night I actually went in and took on another day 70 horde in that base. Look at this landing like a, Feather. I actually went in and took on uh, another Dave 70 horde in, in that uh, sus base, the uh, stun lock base, and it was beautiful, right? Not No broken blocks, no nothing. Nothing but destruction is all it was over there. Um, $661 I could take, I guess. You know, let's just we'll take these little Molotovs too. I probably won't even use them, but uh, first aidy stuff. Uh, I'll just eat that honey blood bags. I guess we'll take those. I mean, you know, I'm probably gonna need those E batteries. I don't think we'll need batteries for anything I think all of this stuff is just junk, but I'm tired of coming back and forth between the two bases uh, All this stuff is uh, these are good. We'll hang on to those cuz I might expect look at that You asked me if I had look at that right there. I must have looted that from somewhere earlier on and just left it here I was carrying around a bone shiv we got all these parts and mods and mods and parts a four quality chainsaw but I think I got a better chainsaw over at the other base I think I have a five quality I don't see anything else here I could mod anything with maybe I could stick that on my knife but that's not really all that important I guess you know maybe um, they yeah, could stick that on there complete it all right smelty thing I got anything more radiators yes uh, kept all those chairs for fuel never even used them Got that. Everything else is good. Anything in here? Nothing. I got a grill. And that's it. Food chest. Well, I better take some of this food because um, yeah, I got none at the other base. All right. Got none. Zero zilch. Nil. Bill breaker. Grandpa's moonshine. What does that do? Oh, that's for melee. Okay. Learning elixir. 20%. I don't know. Maybe we'd use that when we build ourselves a horde base. And the blueberries mean nothing to me. Oh, boy. Hold on. I gotta hide that. I hope I got the right message. Oh, I did. Look at that. I'm all over that. Bad Brian, what's up? Roy? Josh Fincher? Oh, look at a bear right there. That's meat. I shouldn't pass that, but I'm kind of in a hurry to get back to where we got to go. 
It's uh, it's horde day and the horde ain't waiting around. Boy, if I thought I could get off and take this thing back off again, I would scoop that airdrop up. But I don't think I can get off and uh, take back off again. No, no, no. Okay, Russell. So the way it works is if you follow me on Twitter, then you know my setup because you've seen the pictures. I have two PCs. I have one PC for gaming. Everything that has to do with gaming uh, and only game, the only thing running right now on my gaming PC is seven days to die, right? It's beautiful. No stutter, lag, none of that stuff. The only thing that's running on my capture PC is OBS to capture it. And Discord. Now, right now with this white screen, I'm at about 69, 70% CPU in all one color. And um, if it's a bunch of beautiful colors, you know, green and blue and all those colors, oh, it's fine. But if it's one solid color, it's trying to real time encode, it has a problem with just one solid color. And I say a problem, it's not really a problem, it just. You know, it's trying to render all that one color, all black, all white, or whatever. And it, it's kind of strange. You'd think when there were multiple colors on this uh, screen, it'd be fine. If you aren't seeing a, a difference over on your end, no stutters or skips or anything like that, then it's fine. I can just see when it says encoder overload, and it gets about 93, 4% or something like that. But it's only for a second, and then it goes away. But I never see that. So um, it's just the all gray all black screens that really put a burden on it for a few seconds here or there Reb and Dav what's up yes Reb and Dav Gamer RP Joe Mama Quip sneaking up in here well how close am I to my base I didn't even mark a little quick waypoint but I gotta be getting close right I'm gonna crash into a building here in a second <laughs> oh man Let's uh, slow down because my bed's getting big. I should see the smoke from the trader is what I should see. Yeah, so two separate PCs. One for gaming, one for capturing, streaming. Um, you know, I can be running one frame per second or a thousand frames per second on the gaming PC. And it has no effect on the streaming PC at all. Uh, it should be very consistent quality, right? I don't get the greatest, um, what is it called on YouTube servers? I, I can't think of the term I'm looking for, but I don't get very good. YouTube's not all that great for it, but, uh, uh, you know, it is, it is what it is. Oh, that vulture's going to get got. So I'm kind of at the mercy of YouTube also. I can have the best quality in the world, but transcoding, transcoding. Didn't think of the word. I saw the feather fly when I hit him. It didn't kill him, though. This thing's not very powerful. Lampy, you haven't noticed any on your end? That's good. If you're not noticing it, then it doesn't even matter, right? It doesn't matter what I see over here, as long as you're not seeing it. I just keep checking on my garden because I need to redo that. As soon as it's done, I need to replant all that. Christina and Mark, what's up? No, no, uh, transcoding. YouTube's transcoding. My bandwidth's not an issue. I have a thousand up and a thousand down, right? So I can stream. I was streaming last uh, year at 50,000 bit rate. I think the maximum allowed on Twitch is something like um, 8,000. And if you go over that, they'll pop you for... Um, DDoSing, if you go over that, you ban your account. Oh, I ran out of wood in that thing. Uh, they let some of the top streamers, those big boys, you know, with the tens of thousands of viewers get away with about 10,000 uh, bit rate. But on YouTube, there's no limit. If I want to run a, um, if I want to run 50,000 bit rate, I run 50,000 bit rate. And I'm running currently an 18,000 bit rate on here. So uh, it's really, really, really high for uh, what it is that I'm doing here. But. I want to try to get the best quality out to all of you that I can possibly get. This buckshot's got to go away. These weapons, we need an actual weapons chest. The mini bike doesn't belong in there either. But I got no place to put all my bullets. I mean, that's a good problem to have though, right? Got all of these uh, bullets and uh, no place to put them. 
let's uh let's make some uh some some ammo here what can we make 762 that's probably what i use the most let's do 178 of those or 333 of those i think i'm just gonna go with the regular 333 of those and that'll free up a couple extra slots put my gunpowder back in here the tips just the tips see how it feels joshua jeffrey yeah all the dart traps are good surf punk what's up thank you thank you uh surf punk hey surf punk i don't know if you're into it at all uh outdoorsy kind of stuff but uh but i got another channel i'm gonna link that up because i hadn't linked it up in a in a while and uh or i haven't been doing it regularly enough i get i need to get nightbot to do that uh but there's a grand outdoors right trying to develop a, a farm out there and, and get it all fixed up and you know so we can Hopefully start turning a profit one day instead of spending money. We could be making it. Um, all right, that's full. Ugh, what else do I have here? Paper. I'm never going to make shotgun shells. I got so many shotgun shells I'll never even use here. Okay, let's make another storage chest. I need nails. All right, here we go. Here's the base going to work right here, hopefully. Is a feral sense on? Now, nah, uh, Mark, you're only gonna get it. You're only gonna get it at whatever you're. If you're set on auto, Mark, it might have you at 144 or something. But if you turn it up to, uh, it's not like Twitch. It's not like Twitch where you're accepting what I'm giving you. YouTube is is way way different than that. And uh, so I could be streaming at a hundred thousand bit rate and you're gonna still watch it just like you watch something at 144 you know as long as you can stream a 1080 video you can watch my stream you know you should never get buffering maybe you're gonna get buffering if you're on a cell phone and you don't have very good service where you're at or something like that you don't have a lot of bandwidth left over maybe but uh but no it should never you know someone with i can watch my streams uh, on my cell phone at full 1080 if I wanted to you know I don't but I could uh, I have in the past so well this chest right here mods and parts and parts and mods TFI what's up I guess I could just stick some things in here temporarily yeah I think twitch might have changed now too it used to be if you were sending out an 8,000 bit rate the person watching was accepting that 8,000 uh, and there was no fluctuation. I think you can adjust it now, but you might have to be a partner to adjust. You know what I mean? You might not be able to do that if you're just a, an affiliate or something like that, not a true partner like those uh, big boys and girls. All right, sort that. That looks better. I like the way that looks now. Much more better. But we got to have a gun chest. We got to have a gun chest. So let me get some nails going. I know I must have enough iron here somewhere. Or whatever it was died i heard it go Ugh. okay here we go i can make a few nails this way i just need 10 i just need 10 nails i can make 20. perfect i hope so alpha shepherd wolf i don't know if i will make shotgun turrets or not marky if i make any turrets what's up sarah um i might and victor thank you victor Enjoy some tamales. Nice. Uh, storage. Two of those. Uh, it's it's going to be hard because I'm trying to stream every day this week, which is really off, weird, different for me. I don't normally do that. I'm usually a Tuesday, Thursday, Friday guy. But uh, I'm going to try. I'm going to try to get a video up on the Grand Outdoors. It's, it's not going to be easy for me, though. All right, well, you, we can just stick both of those there. This is going to be for uh, guns. Weapons. We'll just type weapons because uh, we'll stick more than just guns in there. No guns in there. Um, no guns in here. Let's do another sort and get those all situated. And the other guns. What did I do right there? Okay. Guns and ammo. Weapons. Well, I need one for ore. I need one for ore. Like smelty stuff. 
TFI, thank you for subscribing and welcome to the channel and stream. Thank you. Thank you. Smelty stuff. Is that all the smelty stuffs that I got? Let's uh, let's do that. Let's stick this in there. Oh, we got a little bit of fuel left. Here are all my bullet casings. Uh, enough jars I could go get water if I could find some water somewhere. Where? Oh, there's water everywhere. Okay, there's water right there. Let's uh, let's put that in our food chest. Just trying to get myself set up for the stream. What we did last night and riding around on the gyrocopter and stuff felt like we didn't waste time, but we didn't get a lot done around here. So I got to kind of catch up tonight and we're going to be doing some more building onto this base that I'm pretty excited to do uh, immediately following the horde. I guess I could start a little bit with it, but um, we might just wait. We might go loot a POI or something, do a little quick quest and then get to uh, to doing that. Nah, not at all, room with a point of view. That that's um so my folks are friends with someone who did that, and it was such a headache. People find out you're growing that stuff, even if it doesn't have the properties of the real stuff. Thank you, Caesar. Thank you for that. Uh what's up, Shannon? Even if it doesn't have that, people will break into your place and steal it. Right? And uh the gentleman was growing. I want to say he had 20 acres of it. It was just a small field, right? 20 acres of it. Oh, I don't need to get on that. Have anything in storage? And uh, he could not keep the thieves out with razor wire and barbed wire and electric fence. All of the stuff he had. The cameras, they didn't care. They just knock. They drive through it with their car. They do whatever they had to do to get in there just to steal it. It's like, really? It can't even do anything for you, Brock. It can't do anything for you. Thank you, Brock. Thank you for that. Thank you, Brock. Look at that. 15 months right there. 15 months. Hey, Brock. The trader restocked with some meat stew. <gasps> Urban combat. 10% more damage. Went indoors and take five less. Thank you. <laughs> a bottle of acid. I'll get that. Some bacon and eggs. What? Take look at that. Two motorcycles. A crucible. I kind of need that crucible. We, we're going to make our own. We're going to make our own. We got the stuff to make our own. I don't care about the 44 book. Uh, but now that I've done that, Careful check this out. There. I'm going to wear. Now what do you have in there? Now, what do you have in here? Another urban combat to write in a pistol, Pete. I'll buy that one too. Um, anything else? I don't think he has anything else I want. I know the gas can schematic. I don't know that one, but I can spec into it. And the hunter mod schematic, I am not interested in. Okay, we accepted a quest. 916 on Horde Day. We're going to get this. Yeah, that's right, room. You do that here, man. It's uh it's a paint. Plus the government always is coming by your place and you got to let them in and they got to do their inspection and all like, you know, like I said my folks were friends with a gentleman that did that and after a few years of doing it, he's like, you know, I'm done. I'm done with this. So <laughs> They're like, you know, I mentioned that when I first went out there to maybe do that for some some CBD or not. Yeah, CBD oil or something. But no, that, I think I think that would be a mistake. My old man seems to think it'd be a huge mistake. But let me put these back on. Let me do a sort. What is this quest even? Hello? Or a lot of dog kennels here. Those break down into polymers, don't they? Oh, the feral scents. Listen, listen, at them coming. Oh, wait, this is doggos? Hey, 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 hey. Oh, my goodness. This is not good, folks. Look at that thing trying to get up in here. That feral sense. Of... Is he dead? Is he dead? He's wiggling around. I don't know. Oh, he dead. Oh, got it. No, 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 Edgar. Woo. Woo. <laughs> 
<laughs> what? AVB, what up? Come on. The old fridge. Oh, they're going to be, they're going to be Alpha Shepherd Wolf. I mean, I don't know how serious it is there, but you're going to prison here for five years per plant, right? They ain't playing no games here. <laughs> I'm like, oh, you want to grow some, huh? Try growing that in prison for five years. Yep, that's where you're going. <laughs> they don't play no games around here with that. No. Can't happen here. Some more stone. I keep getting those because I worry. Come on. Are there no dogs in here anymore? Oh, there are dogs. Look at that. Get out of here, you doggy. You ain't got nothing for me. $418. Hemp clothing is itchy. Yeah, I mean, I'm as ready as I'm going to be, uh, TFI, for Christmas, right? I, We didn't get too crazy today, or this year, just with circumstances and so forth, but we got all that we needed to get done, all right? Ain't, ain't getting no, no more done now. It's too, too close to time. I need to start taking those polymers. Um, I don't know why I just did that. Where are they all coming from? Gotta shoot them till the head comes off. Make sure you get them all. Jeffrey with the 100. What's up with the 100, Jeffrey? Did we get 100 likes, Jeffrey? Or are you just excited and pressing the little 100 thing? Man, I'd just been better off with the hammer the whole time instead of trying to shoot him with that silly shotgun. I might die here. Let's just use one of these. Oh, that's bad. Let's uh, let's fix that for him. How about that? I got to keep my hammer in my hand. So if I don't, bad things can happen. I just have to clear this area, don't I? Oh, there's loot up here. My goodness. Oh, I got a bigger crush can on the end of my gun for a silencer. <laughs> what a cheap silencer that is. I'm going to rub the cream upon my skin. Here to put my looter goggles back on. Looted tootie. 100 likes. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Two taters. That's a, that's a meat stew. And everything else was junk, but... All right, we should be good to go. Might as well slice and dice and get the meats. The meats. <laughs> the meats and the fats and the fats and meats. Oh, I'm an awful shot. All those years of never using a, uh, a gun, you know, only using a club and a crossbow. I heard the zombies, but I didn't see where they were at. There they are. Are you all? Oh, my. Are you all from inside this building or is this? What is this? Part of the quest? Or did you come from outside? They probably came from outside. Feral sense, you know. You lady, you still aren't dead? Just stop it, man. What? Oh, got it. It's kind of laggy in here. Maybe it's because I'm right in the thick of the city and... Oh, the Mrs. is home. 
Don't hug on me. Oh, I can talk to Trader. We did it. Hey, can I get out of here without breaking my leg? Possibly. Yeah. And I'm just destroying everything. Ha ha ha, Gerbil! Wolf on the roof. If you believe, they put a wolf on the roof. Wolf on the roof. Oh, it's legal there. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Legal down here. I don't know what that's like. Hey! You do that here, uh, you're probably going to have a heart stroke uh, from panic and fear that someone smelt it. <laughs> calling the popo. Wait, where am I going? I'm going the wrong way. Why was I going that way? Because there was an airdrop over there. Because there was an airdrop over there and my little red marker was over there. See, that's why I like the motorcycle right there. You see how I can just squee? I just squoze through that tight area like it was nothing. Bobby and I have the turbo mod on this thing. Or did I put it on the... I might have put it on the uh, gyrocopter. That's what I might have done. What's up, Blaze? Yeah, that's crazy. I mean, I, I guess it is in certain states in the U.S., you know? Because you, you can go into dispensaries or you go into shops or whatever and get it, but not here. Nope. Kim with a twenty-five dollar holo. Thank you, Kim. Thank you for that. Kim, there's our horde base. There's gonna be our horde base for the night. We might have to look for a backup because they did a number to that last time. Thank you for that, Kim. Awesome. Nah, TFI, uh, I was thinking you could probably hear. Uh, everyone always comments when the missus is home because the uh, the garage door goes up and it's directly underneath where I sit. So I assume that... Um, this one's close. Fetch and clear. I was, was just assuming that everyone heard the oh from the garage door going up, coming through my microphone. <laughs> All right, we got to drop this off over there. Nah, nah, you don't know the Mrs. If you, um, if you're new to the channel as of the past month or so, hey, you've never been a part of the stream series with the Mrs. But she and I'll be starting up a series together at the turn of the year, so uh, you get to enjoy her antics again. <laughs> Those of you who, you know, know already, poor Mrs. Spartan. Now nah, she does pretty well for what she, uh, you know little bit of time she puts into it uh, crafting do that number we'll just stick that in there this is to sell this is for food I don't know why I have six thousand stone on me it's kind of weird that goes in the smelty box along with that and this is uh sell -y stuff here Okay, uh, we're ready to go knock this next one out. Anything else? I, can, I can't do anything until after the horde is over. Uh, as far as all this goes, because I don't have any resources to put in there, right? I don't have any resources to put in there. Let's check on the garden real quick and see what it looks like. Still just growing. Okay, It should be ready after the horde. Maybe day 29 it'll be ready and then we can get on that. Also, I want to get a new way to get in and out of the base. I want to get that built tonight. And I want to start building over towards where I'm going to put up the horde base. We got enough concrete blocks right now. I feel like I can get the better part of a horde base done. We might not be able to exactly use it. Oh, thank you, Blaze. Thank you for that. Uh, yet, until we get you know, all the traps in place. But we're going to build the base. We're going to build this base right here. Uh, if you're new, then you've probably not seen this. The stun lock in-game build. Uh, that's the one we're going to build right there. And uh, 
there's no horde on the game that should be able to overtake that has two two blade traps two dark traps we'll probably put more in there and i could take my stone sledge and destroy horde knight day 7000 day 70000 doesn't matter that horde base is um is built to uh to take on whatever you got to face but there's a whole preview video of it there's a little intro video uh or an intro base at the beginning uh sure you could use that early game but you're going to want to upgrade from that and uh and build that other one that's later on in the base the sus base we got here lady well i didn't even have time to restart my computer or anything tonight and it's a little bit laggy more so than other times of course i've not done a lot of these quests in the city either so that's new of course, I didn't get that on the uh, prefab or the the uh, pre-made map on opening weekend, streamer weekend. That's a feral radiated zombie right there. Did he die? I think he died. This weapon is not is almost as powerful as the M60. Believe it or not, this nine millimeter SMG. right there I thought I was done for right there he was feral Joey I oh, hadn't got to play it yet Joey well hopefully you get to play it over the Christmas holiday celebrate that kind of thing sir um, would you mind getting back up on the counter just one more time just one more time. Oh, he didn't. He, he resisted it. Oh, no. I was going to make a funny out of him. He didn't like. Oh. A funny being made of him. Oh, bacon and eggs recipe. You know, once you learn something like that, it should remove it from the pool of loot that will drop. You know what I mean? Like, so you're not looting the same thing over and over and over again. I wonder if we can pop this guy's head. I guess, I guess so. <laughs> oh, man. Bob, what's up? Hey, Bob. Uh. Oh, this is outside. Oh, it's a Labor Day sale going on. Why didn't I know this? I don't think it will, Bob, because it's a different trader. I don't I don't think it's a bug, Bob. I think it's intended. I think they want you to have to start over in any new city you go to with a new trader. Um I, I don't know. Have other have other people been saying differently than that? That it's a bug or something? I assume. I assume they want you to, you know have to do quest in uh, different cities and kind of start over and I don't mind that I don't mind having to start over it's fine like cuz so I was uh, I tuned into Jonah's stream for a little bit this morning and he's right uh, and everyone in this chat was saying tier 5 quests are a waste of your time they're too hard and take too long for the little tiny bit of a reward you get from them like he was showing the quest rewards from those things and they were it was pitiful the quest considering it took him an hour plus a full day to clear some of those places those tier five places and you're essentially getting the same thing that you were getting when uh you were doing tier fours right but you could do a tier four a whole lot faster than you could do a five so it's like all right it's showing me there's something down Hey, go back down. Something in a basement down there? I don't even know how to get to that basement. Anybody know how to do this? Because the horde's almost here. I gotta hurry up. A lot more feral zombies. Uh, not necessarily a lot more, but, you know, based on your game stage, it's gonna go up. I really haven't noticed more. It's just, you know, on this series, I have the experience jacked up, so we see demos and cops and all that stuff a lot sooner than... The average person that plays is going to see it. Uh, you're not going to see them that fast. 
All right, that part is done. Talk to Trader. We got it. We did it. All right. Let me make sure we're all reloaded here so we can go back up and, uh, and get out of here. It's uh, Monterey is set up that way for uh, for a reason. Yeah, okay. I can believe that, right? I believe that. And um, no, I'm cool with the way it is. I, I don't mind having to start back over when I go to the wasteland. You're not going to want to... It just get, it opens your options up. And I know that you could always go back. You could go back a quest, I think. But um, I don't mind it being the way it is. CD Mix, what's up? Oh, I got zombies chasing me. And we got to get back and turn this in. Bill, what's up? Yeah, there you go. Same trader quest carry over. So if you get a trader gen, trader gen's going to have those in the next city, you know, your tier that you've done. But if you go to trader wrecked and you've never seen trader wrecked, you got to start over with the quest. That's fine. Yeah, that's fine. Dig? You want me to dig, Quip? <laughs> uh, I'll take the ammo. Uh, I'm not even going to accept another job. We'll just... That's good. You know, uh, we'll just see how fast I can blast through those quests, though. And we're still getting our game stage loot in a Tier 1 or Tier 2 quest. It's not like we're just getting paper and lead and stuff like that. No, we're getting really good loot by doing those Tier 1 and 2 quests, so... It's not so bad. All uh, right. Ammo. This mod can go on the M60, right? We can uh, we can take this. Modify. We can stick that on. It's good. It's a good gun. Weapons. This goes into weapons. Old boy's about to get got. Wait for it. <laughs> I need a little later. Look at they like they a faction, not a person. Thank you for that, Mary. Yeah. Okay. Well, it looks like I caught all of you and what you're saying. Okay. Well, we want this. We want that. And I need to, I don't really need gas in my inventory. Let's get our drink situated. Food, don't need to eat that. I got some, uh, I got some food right there and that's going to be enough for me. Only thing I worry about is if the uh, barn crashes down on Horde Night, we're going to be on the street for the remainder of the night and I'll have to figure that out. And I will play that by ear. I can leave my money here. We'll leave the money in the weapons chest because we're going to be dumping our weapons off anyway on, uh, you know, after Horde Night. We won't need a hammer on our belt. We won't need an auger on our belt. Uh, we shouldn't need a knife. Uh, I need these in case I have to frame up the axe in case I got to break some stuff out. Uh, let's go sniper. Shotgun will be last. And Sean and Mary! Thank you, Sean and Mary, with a $20 donate for this. A20 Wasteland is great. Thank you, Sean and Mary. Sean and Mary, have you ventured off into the Wasteland yourselves? Have you done that yet? Have you been out in the Wasteland yet? A20 Wasteland is great. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Sean and Mary. I put all my repair kits in there. It's a good thing I didn't need them. What up, Agent? Thank you for subscribing and uh, welcome to the channel. And to actually take those there stick them in here all right don't really need a shotgun you know i i think i'm gonna take my uh i think i'm gonna take this off we're leaving the shotgun at home folks it, it's it's okay i i just find that i'm not really using it a lot it's not so great it takes a lot of rounds from it to be effective um rad remover M60. Let's put that extended barrel on this gun. 
Okay, so we got about 600 rounds for it. We're taking all of these rounds. Now, remember, folks, this is the only ammunition I have made since I started playing Alpha 20. It's the only ammo I have crafted. Everything else you saw in my inventory and in this chest, well, the exception to the pipe bombs, I have looted or been given as a quest reward. So, ammo comes in bulk in this Alpha. They are not shy with the ammo they like to give it out they like for you to have lots of it and that's fine i guess it's a different style of play but uh all right repair 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 get everything all repaired up and my axe can stay in here and i can put that on there and i think we're good i think we're ready for horde night what's up john yeah it's more challenging better loot what's up shadow and jocelyn oh jocelyn jocelyn why you gotta do that, Jocelyn? Derek Barlow. Their tactics evolve, but they never learn. Right? I mean, who in here? Raise your hand. Raise your hand. Don't be shy, but be embarrassed. If you are actually gonna go to one of those sites that once someone comes in here and posts, who's actually gonna go there? Is there anyone that actually goes to those places that get posted? I mean, there has to be someone or they wouldn't do it, right? Has to be someone clicking on it. Shame on that person. <laughs> Shame on that person for going. You're not going to get good things if you go there. Coffee beans, water, gunpowder. Yeah, we need to make some black strap. That's a good time right there. Let's see stone 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 we have no stone because it's in the smelty chest stone sand cement concrete mix what we got 3700 let's do 15 right here and 15 in the other 22 in the other from another mother and i don't even know what this chest is down here i guess this is building chest mod Part, part, gas. I don't even know what you call that thing. Um, those are tools. Mods and parts. We'll just stick that drone and that gas in there too. You know, I still got stuff here. Brought those Molotovs and I'm not even going to use them. Let's see. I don't need gas. But we need to put it in the chest where we're going to come back and get our stuff. Which is weapons? Yeah, weapons. Gas. Uh, let's, uh, I don't really need to drink and eat either, do I? And I don't need my stone sledgehammer. We don't need that. That's a waste of a thing in my place. Whatchamacallit. Okay, anything else? Sort. Don't need the stone. Um, don't need this water. And I'm going to eat the meat stew in a minute. That'll take one more slot away from me. I think I just have too much ammo. I really don't think I need this much for Fortnite. I think we'll get by on. We'll be fine. Yeah, okay, now I'm not encumbered. Now I'm, I'm feeling pretty good. What's up, sweet? Oh, big Al clicks on those links. Ugh. 76 Cutlass. Boy, a lot has changed in a few years. A lot has changed. Oh, the garden is looking good. It's looking like it's, uh, it's almost ready. Oh, it's ready. We can harvest it now. Do it now. No potato seeds, though. Look at that. None. I got one potato seed out of all of that. I got four. I got four. All right, let's uh, let's break down what we just got here. I got uh, five corn seed and four potato, so I need two more corn. Okay, that'll give me a full row. I mean, corn I'm not hurting on. It's the potatoes that I'm hurting on. So I actually need three more potato seed. I should probably make all the potatoes into seed. 
since we're not dying from starvation, you know? Because this recipe seed, all of those going to make 14. Maybe I do seven. I'm going to do seven of them so we can do one more row with potatoes. And then uh, next harvest, we'll start making a whole bunch of meat stew. And whatever else. And then we're good. The super cone. Yeah, James, you got to... You got to max out that uh, living off the land. You got to be three of three in that now, right? You got to be three of three in that. No, this is not a horde base, bad bry. What's up, uh, Lem? Just describe. Thank you. Yes. Yes. Thank you. Meat, tater, horn, zombies. Zombie. We need more water. So I'm going to take my jars. I'm going to take this and make it all into boiled water. Let's get some fuel up in here. Okay, that's 344. We got that. Now we need to take our... You know, I should probably... I don't know what we're going to do with this super corn. I don't even know if I really feel like constantly reproducing this stuff. I don't know if it's worth it. Uh, is there anything else I wanted to plant? Had a few more corn seed there. Uh, coffee beans. I mean, we got that coffee. Hops. I could just plant that one. Doesn't make sense to plant that one. All right, let's get our jars. We're gonna go fill these jars up. I got two hundred and uh, I got two hundred and something. Man, I got a lot. What's up, AJ? Alti? Mark? Okay. Um, well, I'm all encumbered, but we're gonna go. Uh, we're gonna go get some water real quick. I need to mark it on my map. Might have some in the ditch right in front of me, but I doubt it. I know there's a pond here. Maybe we just ride over there real quick. We still got time. Um. Uh, Mars, I don't, um, I don't make any of that stuff. The elixirs and all that stuff. Yeah, I never make that. Uh, I use it for glue. I use super corn for glue. But here in the wasteland now, with the amount of animals, vultures and all that stuff. I, I, if I, if I would just knife all of the vultures that I kill on a daily basis. Oh, we'd be okay. Look at that zoom right there. Look, I can't even hit her. I shot her right between the eyes, but it didn't even hit her. Oh, I missed that time. She's so close to me. <laughs> I was like looking up her nose. All right, here we go. What's up, Thor? Yeah, it should be stable. Zephyr? You know, I never even looked at Twitter uh, to confirm that. You all were asking me. I just haven't had time, but I... Only thing I was I did was I jumped on there long enough to tweet out that I was going live one master alti They remove plants staying after harvest. Yes, you don't use a chance that you get your seed back now It's not a it's not a guarantee, right? Okay, let's take this in my inventory Get the uh, fuel up in there and type in meat Meat stew. Makes me so happy. I don't know what to do. That's 19 meat stew right there, folks. We ain't going hungry for a while. No. Nope. Beautiful. That's the point we've been trying to get to for a long time now. And we finally reached that point, And it feels very good. So this is mostly going to be for glue this water. We might make some into some, uh, you know, boiled water. But for the most part, that's going to be for, uh, for meat stew. Uh, I need to heal, so let's, uh, let's just use this. Uh, I'm gonna drink one of these. Get some pipe bombs on my belt. Do a sort. And let's go over here to this little place. Um. 
Oh, I don't really have anything, Thomas, that I dislike about the Alpha. I, you know, I'm a big fan of Seven Days. Look, I, you know, it's the only thing I've ever paid $20 for that I've gotten over 7,000 hours of entertainment. And not only that, but I've been able to entertain you all for five or six years or something like that off of $20 game all those years ago from 2013 you know so whatever they do i'm i'm all for it right it's like a new game every time they release an alpha and it's just been great it's been great and uh i don't have any complaints well this old uh desert vulture is not bad not bad. Well, here's where we took on the horde last time. Uh, no, there's still zombies that respawned in here. He's dead in one shot. Come on, man. Really? You're going to fall down? like? Oh, I killed that guy with the shot behind the ear. Oh, I'm shooting him right in the booty. Right in the booty. You going to bunk it all up? You getting popped in it, son. What up, bad bry? Retired guy. Having to build up tiers with each trader? No, that's fine. That's fine. It's like I said, with the traders, I came to the wasteland. I had Trader Jen in the forest biome. I spawned in over here, right? Got the little Trader Jen. Hey, right? I do those quests. And I'm never going to do fives. Fives take too long. You don't get the... You're basically doing it for the experience. And when you get to my stage, you don't even need that. You're just kind of spinning your wheels. It's just something to do, I guess. Especially after watching uh, Jonah this morning. I don't know if I'll ever really want to do one of those. Uh, but the tier... Five, so when I got to the Wasteland, my game stage, my loot stage, 270, right? So when I loot stuff, it's good. Well, when I go through and do a tier one quest... I'm getting loot stage 270 gear from that quest, that tier one quest. So I don't mind at all, right? I mean, the rewards might not be great, but you also get to build your way back up through all the tiers again and get the bonus quest rewards from each tier. So that's also a bonus. I like it. What's up, Mo? Texas, AJ, more value than your truck? <laughs> Yeah. 19 minute for 19 meat stew. Well, you can't just rush something so great. Cold beer, what's up? Jimmy? What up? Acid being rare makes those good drinks hard to make now. I don't mess with anything that takes acid except for what I gotta have. Um, you can't make acid, right? So... What you want to get yourself is you want to get this thing right here. And I was really fortunate that it was one of the first that I got. Number three, Wasteland Treasures. Chance to harvest acid from cars and medical equipment. You get that, you're going to be able to make the stuff you want to make. You don't get that, you really got to be careful. You got to buy. I still buy it all from the trader, even though I have that book. I still buy it. The other one that's good to have from that, the uh, this one. Doorknobs for most doors, right? You just take your little auger and ding, ding, ding. Doorknob. Every door, right? If you want to cheese the quest, you can cheese the quest and get double the doorknobs from all the doors you're going to loot. So uh, that's cool too. But yeah, this place held up last time. The vultures did break in up here. Um, I'm not going to worry about that. I got guns, right? And the vultures don't. So they can come on down and try to peck on me if they want. But uh, they're just going to get a bullet to the face. What's up, Billy? And Ibrahim, Michael, uh, I'm not a big fan of pistols, Michael. I'm not a big fan. I'm not a big fan of any guns, but they kind of force your hand in that now. You, you know, I want to try bows because I know they're great. I just wonder what is a bow going to do to a feral radiated white or a feral radiated cop? Like, are you really going to be able to take them out when there's eight of them coming at you and you're shooting arrows at them, you know? So, I want to explore all of that. We're going to try all of that. Sure, you could probably kill them if you could stealth shoot them, but you're not doing that on Horde Night. So, the whole stealth build thing still is a little iffy for me because, sure, you're stealth day-to-day -day doing quests and POIs, but it doesn't benefit you on Horde Night. So, 
Uh, email us up. You, I think it's a uh, 44. You got to go have the 44 Magnum. It's this book right here. Um, what is it called? Sniper Tech Junkie. Boy, I got all the Tech Jumpy Junkie books. We need to. We need to put that to use. Where's that at? Right here. Bartering with a 44 gun drawn gives you a 5% better deal. No, I, I just, I don't even utilize that. Right? I just throw those things away. Well, here they come. Uh, we're going to conserve ammo because I want to build a horde base. I don't want to have to, uh, I don't want to waste too much ammo. But I, don't, I already don't like this scope, folks. We're, uh, we're taking that off. We're taking that off right now. Ugh, scopes are awful. I just don't like them. It, it destroys your peripheral too. So if you're if you're being attacked from the side or above or whatever, you're not gonna know it, right? You're not gonna know it because you're all zoomed in. Oh, he's dead. This thing's got a lot of power to it. Oh, he didn't die. I thought he was dead. Well, that's uh, that's pretty suspect. Pretty sketch. <laughs> I think they're all piled up on the backside. Hey, if it hits the ground, if it hits the ground, then uh, we go find ourselves another POI to uh, set up in for Horde Night, right? We'll have to clear it. We'll have to clear it, which is not the easiest thing to do on Horde Night, but I have confidence. Yeah, they're just chewing out the walls on that side over there. That's why this is falling. Uh, this is the second Horde we've taken on in this barn because uh, I just didn't have a base yet. And she pooped out a little loot sack. If they would come over here and pile up, we drop some pipe. Oh, here, here they come. Here they come. All right, that should uh, that should thin the herd. Thirty thousand. <laughs> Donkey, what's up, Chris? Yes, fifty percent damage on arrows and fifty percent uh, reload speed, draw speed on the the. But man, when you got 64 zombies screaming breathing down your neck and you're trying to shoot them with bows i, I just don't know man I, I have to try it right i just have to try it there's no way to know until you try it you can't knock it till you try it so maybe it's excellent and maybe i can decimate uh a horde on this difficulty level with uh arrows but i don't know oh i popped mama's head while she was running oh there's more zombies right here they're gonna collapse this area i'm standing on if i'm not careful it's all right. There they go. Chelsea! What's up, Simon? Simon, a rip. Why are you ripping already, man? I'm up here just killing zombies. Like it ain't nothing, man. Let's uh, spread out the love a little bit here. Oh, I keep bouncing them. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! We'll save the M M60. You know what I didn't bring? I, I did make a big boo-boo here, folks. I didn't bring any beer along with me for when we hit the ground. We can just uh, take off and not have to worry about being stunned or running out of stamina. think you're an elf from Lord of the Rings? Legolas? I think I'm Legolas? I am not legless, sir. Mama down. Mama tried, mama tried. Mama tried to teach me better. He went for a little trip. <laughs> oh, a little head poppage. Yeah, well, I, I got a feeling we're going to be hitting the ground running here in, any moment now. Look at all those zombies piled up over there. I guess they're coming in from that side, huh? What's up, Selena and Bobo? 170 likes. Thank you, folks. Thank you. 
and we're just we're just taking it easy here on these horde knights until we can get a proper base and then you're gonna see some crazy stuff right you're gonna see the crazy stuff that you saw in that video i linked up uh the base build video i posted a, a few days ago you're gonna see that real time here live we just gotta get it built right we'll just play it all safe until we get that thing built no need to get crazy I mean, I might hit the ground here in a minute and break my leg and have to break out the M60 to survive, but let's, uh, let's cap these back off again. No vultures yet. Remember all the vultures last horde? They kept pecking away. No vultures yet, which is kind of strange. Let's see what I can do with the old Pistola. Oh, I just flipped him upside down. We're silly. Same with him. Almost need a two-time scope on this thing. You know what I mean? Shot mama right in the center of the back. Hey, Ali. Thank you for subscribing and welcome. Don't you squirm around on me. Oh, bad Bri, you did remind me. Look at that. Look at that. I can't even read that name. Coming up in here. Black Cell? Crazy. Crazy. Oh, feeling so lonely. Get out of here, mountain man. Shoot you with a 44. Look at him stumbling and staggering over there. I think he got all the beer, bad Bri. <laughs> hey, I wonder if I could safely navigate this thing over here and make him come back around the other way. And I wonder where they all are, right? This is just a handful. This is 64 Max Alive. There should be a lot of zombies somewhere. They're probably just destroying this place. You know, I, I don't know where they all are, but they're somewhere. Somewhere out there. Oh, what a head pop on that girl. Got you too, sucker. Oh, I got the number for that guy. You can't see a talk on thing for the flame off the end of this gun. Yeah, I have uh, the Crucible schematic even better yet, Thomas. Uh, so I can make uh, unlimited Crucibles, which is very important. If you want to get to the next tier. 40k pop right there. A 40k pop. You know what I'm talking about? Why they're just tearing this place up? Like I don't know where they're tearing this place up. Let's let's build our way up here a little bit uh, and see if we can figure out where it is that they're destroying what and where they're located. Oh my goodness! I don't want to die. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Well, that was close. That was a pucker moment right there. Tyler Kitt, thank you for subscribing and welcome to the stream. Oh, cop about to pop. Oh, yeah, they dead. They dead. Oh, no. Oh, man. Yeah, it's just free experience right now. I mean, they might make us pay for it here in a little while, but right now it's nothing but free. Well, I don't want to shoot. I don't want to shoot the board out right under my foot. That wouldn't be good. Where are you going? You can't get away from me. No need to try to run. Padre, what's up? David? Thank you, David. We're doing well. I hope you are also. Oh, my God. Oh, I landed on the zombies. So it was a nice squishy fall. I thought I was, I thought I was done for. I thought I was going to break my leg right there. Nope. Oh, there's a landmine? Did I just step on a landmine or something? What did I step on? All right, we got the M60. We're probably going to be okay. <laughs> oh. Woo! 
You gotta get on up. Well, I was just looking down. I was like, oh, look at a pretty horde down there. Oh, it's a beautiful zombie parade. And then yeet. And we're right back to where we started, folks. Just like that. No need to fear. Yeah. Nah, you haven't seen anything yet. Just wait till I can uh, get you that base right there that I posted. What's up, Goyle? Just wait till I can build that on here. You're going to see a ball pit of loot sacks. And we're just... It's going to... They're going to be red and blue and... A lot of them. A bed, what's up? What you gonna do, copper? Oh, uh, more of the bases falling, or the, the barn, the shed, the hold up. Well, that thing sounds like it's got some power, doesn't it? But you just gotta hit him to do the damage, right? Oh, I got him, I think. I need points in something. Some kind of a weapon. Other than my hammer. <laughs> Takes so long for the uh, for the little reticle to close back up on that thing. Because I don't have any points into it. I'm not perked into it. Yeah, it makes kind of a, a boring horde night up here. This is not the most exciting thing ever. But uh, it's pretty easy. And um, we're getting a lot of experience and some loot sacks. Not that I even really need that stuff, but uh, this will get us by until we can build that uh, that base in the video I just linked you there. Hey! You gonna shoot up at me? I'm gonna shoot down at you. Oh, David, I try to say hello to everyone, right? And if you ask questions, I like to talk to you. I like to answer your questions and interact with you. John, what's up? Control bursts on M60? Yeah, yeah, you got, you got to. I was just holding down just to be like Rambo for a little bit, but it doesn't really work so well. Where did that policeman go? Oh, I'm here somewhere. Did he just, where did he take off to? How did he just disappear like that? I didn't kill him. Oh, there he is. Looks like it's time for a... Ooh! Hey! Well, they're just shooting the blocks off of this thing. Oh, I hear vultures now. Brian, what's up? Crew? Hello, 200 likes. Thank you, folks. Thank you for the 200 likes. It's amazing. You know, I could probably drop down to this next level right here. I don't think they can get up there. Can they get up there? I don't think they can. Let's uh, let's drop down. I mean, if we got to hit the ground running, we got to hit the ground running. It's just another day uh, that I got to do that. There was a sleeper standing right there. It's such a waste of ammo doing that. Right, I could just drop pipe bombs, like three or four pipe bombs that are so easy to make and kill all of them in one fell swoop. Until they all run away right as I drop them. Well, not all of them, but some of them did. Oh, there are a lot of them over here. They're chewing down the walls is what they're doing. Hey, this floor is uh falls out, doesn't it? Oh, yeah, it does fall. I don't know where to drop the pipe bombs. Like, I don't know where the best place is to drop them. Yeah, two hordes in this barn, man. 64 max alive. It's, uh, it's been... Yeah, 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 yeah. That was a, a collapsing floor. It's been doing the trick for me. Look at this sleeper right here, sleeping through all this action.
Those are just sleepers. That's not part of the horde right there. Those are just sleepers in this old barn. Hey, let's walk over here and see what's on this side. Oh, there's another sleeper. Uh, hopefully they can't get up here on this ladder. If if they can, then I just showed them the way. Oh, there goes the car. Oh, yeah, it's almost 4 a.m., isn't it? Yeah, and then we'll just, um, we'll save this and we'll do our last bit of cleanup with it on, uh, at 4 a.m. Well, I kind of like this SMG. Remember how useless it used to feel? And then they really buffed it up. The damage on this thing is comparable to the M60, which is insane. Because 9 millimeter ammo is everywhere. Recoil is not so bad either. The the fire uh, off of the end of the M60 and the recoil is terrible. Yeah, they can climb ladders, but they got to be able to get to the ladder, right? And those ladders are up a couple blocks, so. All right, this is a perfect placement for a few pipe bombs up in here since they seem to be scattered about all around this area. Let's do this thing real quick and see what we get. Nice. I wonder if I could stand on the edge of that thing. They could probably get to me if I did, didn't they? Doesn't even really matter because it's 4 a.m. Oh, this is perfect, though. Look at this. Oh, my. The cop shot me and I started bleeding. I don't think that's ever happened before. A bleed from a cop spit? That's strange. Really, Vulture? Oh, they're coming out of that barn now. I don't think I killed a single zombie with that. There we go. Oh, I need running guns so desperately. Oh, he's going to pop. Somebody's popping. Oh! Oh! A double pop! <laughs> Let me reload my M60. Don't don't touch me, man. Oh, he's on the raw. I came to this side, and he's on that side. Don't you do it, man! Give me time to reload. A lot of these zombies that are left were not feral. All right, I'm tired of playing with them now. You see that? That's an example. That's what's going to happen to you. And then you just go away. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Yeah, David Moore. I recognize the name, man. I recognize the name. Well, welcome back, sir. It's good to, good to have you back. See you. Yeah, I had to get rid of the public Discord. Right. I had problems. Look at that. 400 bullets up in that one chest. 9mm. 400 in that blue bag. 
It's like ammo is bullets, brass, and beer in every one of these. And blood bags. Bullets, brass, beer, and blood bags. Every one of them. Look at that. I don't even know what you use this for anymore. Let's let's look at it. None of the stuff I'm going to be using, so we don't need that. You better get out of my inventory. Hey, what you doing, man? What you doing? Hold up. That was not loaded. Loaded now. Oh, I hear a snake. Slithery snake. Bullets, brass, and beer. And blood bags. And a can of peas. Oh, four quality auger. And a snake. Oh, I oh God, you see that thing? All right, we got to get uh, picky about what we're going to keep here because I'm kind of collecting more stuff than what I really have room for. I might have to come back. We'll probably never come back. I say I'm going to come back and I never come back. Oh, there's a piggy right there, Mark. Mark, you see that piggy just standing here all horn night? Look at that. Look at that. He's a good little boy. Oh, I done made him angry now. Oh, he's coming back. <laughs> My dog bark when I did that. Oh no. Bullets, brass, and beer, and an impact driver. Some money. Probably sell that impact driver, you know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? Uh, might as well use that steroid, that Lance juice. Can't carry anything else? What? We'll have to come back, but probably not. I say I'm going to come back, but I never come back. It's hard not to uh, take that stuff, though. You know what I mean? Let's scrap that. And it's hard not to take the ammo. They're just freely giving it to you like that. I mean, darn. The money can stay. The bullets got to go. Uh... That's 16 trophies that I do not want to scrap. Oh, let's eat the meat. i probably just go ahead and eat that. because we got. And I'm going to take this too. Because we got uh, plenty of uh, food back at the base there. Now, I don't too much worry about it, Brian. I'm in a place right now in the game where I really don't need most of this stuff. It's just extra, right? It's just extra. Um... So I don't get too crazy about it. it. It won't despawn. If you loot it like this and you click on it, uh, for the most part, it will stay on the ground for a long time. We'll come back here a long time from now and this stuff will still be just sitting here. So um, there's a good chance that, you know, it will still be here when we come back. But we probably won't ever because I'm just like that. I say, oh, yeah, we're going to come back and get all of that. And we never come back. We never come back. I'm going to repair and sell that. I wonder what a four quality would sell for. Well, there's still some loot up in there. The one and only. The one and only Lee. One and only Lee. And I'm looking through my stuff here. That can go there. And the auger. Dog on it. Um... Uh, Let's just scrap this. It's not really going to scrap. Wait, where's my base at? Oh, it's right here. <laughs> I got lost for a moment. I didn't know where my base was. No, I mean, I had my motorcycle right here. I could have just shoved a bunch in there, but I didn't really leave much valuable stuff behind that I need, like ammunition. I took all of that. I should have grabbed a quest last night, so we just immediately jump back in and knock that tier two chain out. Tonight. All right. Ammo. Look at all of this. This is crazy. This is a crazy amount of ammo to say I've I've only crafted 300 rounds since I started playing uh, on this series. Look at that. Look at that. I don't even have a place to stick all my stuff. All my ammo. Um, there comes a something. What is this coming through the gate? He did. 
Be gone. I'm going to have to get a first aid chest also. Uh, boy, I really don't want to stick pipe bombs in the smelty chest. But, you know, uh, let's cancel these trophies. These trophies will smelt down beautifully. It's a lot of them, too. And jars, empty water jars. Okay, what we really need to do, I, I know you don't want to hear this, but what we really need to do is go mine. I, I don't have anything else left to smelt down. I'm out. I'm completely out of smelty stuff, right? Oh, I had 56 trophies right here to put along with that. 15, there you go. 71 trophies to smelt. That's a lot. Uh, but I, I don't. I don't have anything else left to smelt, so... We got one stack of stone, no metal, not even a stack of clay. We're, we're hurting for resources. So why don't I take this gun? Uh, let's see what mods we can stick on this thing right here. The barrel extender? Nah. We'll just leave it the way it is. Let's um, get our auger. Put all these away. Let's get this here. I'm going to get my hammer right there. Get the money. I uh, just need a couple stones for repairing. Get the knife in case we want to, uh, you know. And then uh, these are our Horde Knight weapons if we do use those again at some point. Bullets. Go in there. What am I forgetting, folks? Because it feels like I don't have everything. I'm not for I'm not remembering. Oh! Look at that big gun! Oh, my God! 19 meats too that's so much we've been building towards that point for a long time now finally got it finally got to where we can just look i don't even need to eat i just ate one just just for celebration and we'll take this impact driver we'll cap out salvage operations and we'll go around and just wrench the world 4.7 a honey should take care of that Flyman? Three stacks to each trader to sell? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, coffee and rot busters. Thank you, folks, for reminding me. I would never have remembered that. Uh, we're taking two. We're probably not going to be there that long, but we'll take two just in case. I got this old auger here. Sells for 2000 uh, I could stick it in this chest. And look, I got a five-quality chainsaw for... Um, Chopping down trees, which we're going to have to do because I don't really have uh, very much wood. I, I got 913 wood left. That's all I got. We're really looking for a six quality auger so we can put that fourth slot on there. And that will give us the grave digger, the bunker buster, and the iron breaker. Whatever those things are called. Uh, that can go in there. Ammo. We only need... Eh, we'll go with two stacks, and that's worst case scenario right there. We should be able to kill anything. But what am I forgetting here? What am I forgetting that's not on my belt? I got my hammer. I got my SMG. I got a knife, blocks, axe, and auger repair kits and gas. That should be all that we need for mining, right? Should be all that we need. And, um, yeah, I, I ate a honey, so that should take care of that. The quickest, easiest way that I know to handle this... Uh, Kamali and Lunar, what's up? It's going to be to fly over to... Thank you for subscribing. Uh, is to fly over to the forest biome. Oh, I had this ammo. All, th this is crazy, the amount of ammo we have on there. I, I, can't, I don't even have a place to put it all. That's insane. We need to get auto turrets, right? Problem with auto turrets and why I don't really use shotgun turrets. They trigger demos. That's bad, right? You don't want to trigger those things. And so... Food for digging? Dude, I got nine meat stew and nine red teas to wash all that down with. Look at all of that. Look at all that. Let's take a few... Let's take four of those and make them into cement blocks. Cement... No, concrete. Concrete, not cement. Concrete shapes. Another 400... These are cobblestone. We're going to need those too. Like I said, I'm about to expand this that way. And that's where we're building our horde base. It'll be attached to this one. But not attached, attached, you know, because they're going to attack this. We'll have it separated. You got to keep them separated. Uh, oh, the garden. Garden's good. Garden's good. We can expand that later. 
and I'm gonna do it now. And I gotta get a, a better way in and out, and I'm gonna show you how I wanna do that. Can I do black strap? I could, but I'd have to make it, and I don't wanna take time to do that. Uh, we're just gonna go over here. I got a place right on the other side. There's one for coal. We're not gonna need that. Iron and nitrates right here. Iron nitrate clay. This is where we're going. And we can also stop by Trader Gen Bob. I am not carrying this auger. Let's take the things we want to sell her real quick. And when we land down over there, uh, you got it. Yeah, I, see, I'm, I'm making a better way up here. Uh, maybe tonight. I hope I have time to do it tonight. We want to sell this. We want to sell... We got to keep the diamonds for the diamond tip blade mod. I don't even have that recipe, so... $661. I think that's all that we had. I don't know why there's coffee in that chest. That's strange. I think that's it, right? That's the only thing I had to sell. Hey, how much does a, bo a, a thing of block sell for? $337. Or six it sells... This is crazy. Look at this. This takes 5,000 concrete and time to make. Sells for $337. The actual mix, 1,000 sells for double the amount. Isn't that crazy? That can only make 100 blocks. That's 500 blocks. Drop the mini bike off at the old base. Uh, did I bring my Jimmy? I don't know. Hold on. I mean, yeah, it's here. I brought that. That's with me. I just want to get all the way over there and be like, oh, I can't believe I came all the way over there. I forgot to get that thing. I think that's it. All right. I haven't really used the drone much. I, I, I looted that thing a little while back, and I just haven't used it much. I mean... I know it's extra space, but I rarely even use my motorcycle and gyrocopter for space. It's rare. Up, up, and away we go. Well, that was a quick takeoff. Sell the weapons at the old base? I could, right? I could. I'm not going to waste repair kits on them, but I could sell them. They could bring, uh, you know, a couple, two, three thousand or something like that. Matthew Brown went up. They made Trader Gen thick. Really? I think she was already that way. Why am I a little bit heavy to the left? Am I am I leaning to the left today? Is that hanging to the left? Is that what's, what's going on? Um, going to put a runway on the roof? I probably should, huh? So we could just take off up there. John the Icon Robinson. Now, nah, John, we'll use it, right? We'll use a... Uh, yeah, there's a John Schmidt. There, we got a John squad. We, uh, we'll we use all that ammo. We'll make turrets. We'll figure out a way to use it, right? I'm not going to sell it. It's It takes too long to harvest coal, nitrate, cook it into gunpowder, smelt the brass, smelt the lead, smush it all together to make it into bullets to just sell it for a little bit of money, right? I'd rather have it as an asset than just a, give me a little bit of money that I may never spend on anything. Make two mini bikes. No, I had a mini bike. I left it at the other base. Uh, probably wouldn't have been a bad idea, but if we die, we go back over to the other base where I have a motorcycle. Uh, so I can just drive back over here. If we die over uh, there or here, oh, well, that doesn't make sense because we would spawn back over there. But either way, we can get back and forth. Uh, I probably won't uh, leave the mini bike at the uh, at this base. Oh, sweep. I was not the one selling those things. I was really late to that game. You all told me about it. Like, hey, you know, Cage or somebody's selling uh, concrete blocks by the stack. And I was like, really? And I had so much of it. I was like, okay, I'll sell some. But no, I, you know, I was not the one that started that. Trader Jen got the Lara Croft evolution. Wait, Lara Croft. Isn't that that lady that's shaped like a stick or like a Q-tip? What's her name with the tattoos? Uh, Brad Pitt's ex. What's her name? She doesn't have any shape to her, does she? She's like a stick thin lady. Looks like she just got off a of hookworm treatment. Can't think of her name. Unless they don't. Unless I'm thinking about a different person that played that movie. Oh boy. Aha. Uh -huh. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Hide. There's our hole right there. Yeah, we'll be doing a drawbridge uh, between the two. 
is what we'll be doing. Oh, I, I need to sell this. Uh, don't let me forget to sell this auger that's on my belt. Rotbusters. Angelina Jolie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think she got... Uh, you might be talking about the video game version of... Uh, of that character and not the movie, right? <laughs> Angelina Jolie, that's her. Brad Brad Pitt's ex, right? Yeah, I thought that was right. I mean, I'm just saying, Mike, she does she's not thick, right? She ain't got no big booty and all of that, like what somebody said. She's just like a stick thin lady, probably wears 95 pounds soaking wet. Oh, she played back in the day. I don't know. I never saw any of those movies. I just saw the the previews to them, right? So. Oh, video game Laura Croft. Okay. I've never seen that Laura Croft. Yeah, I've never seen that one. So I'm just getting some stone. We're going to need it. We need everything. We need stone, sand, clay, iron. Uh, we're probably pretty good on gunpowder right now. I'm going to make some more pipe bombs, but um, we won't even be using those on Horde Night soon, as soon as I get this base build. Oh, we got zombies coming. We got the zombies. Hey, why is there a loot sack here with an iron armor in it? And why did a zombie just fall out of nowhere? Oh, he fell down in the hole. Oh, he brought me another one. Boy, they like dropping these. Look at that. Look at that stuff. Right, we can't waste this coffee and we can't waste this candy. We got to get all we can get while we can get it. Get out of here. Get back over there and get this stuff of smelting and the building. Expanding this base. Making our way over so we can build a horde base to attach to it. Jeff, what's up? Same to you. Thank you. Coffee gives no extra harvest for auger anymore, Green Viper? Harvest 10% more ore when buzzed from coffee. It's the third book in Art of Mining. But you gotta read it. You can't just drink a coffee on day one and go pick something and expect to get 10% more. You gotta read that book first. Unless it's bugged out and not working, and if that's the case, then a bug needs to be reported so they can fix that. Team Jennifer Aniston. Yo, Jennifer Aniston still looks pretty good for her age too, right? She's uh, she's looking pretty pretty decent, pretty decent gal. Of course, that is a lot of makeup, but uh, yeah, she looks all right. Yeah, I never I never watched that show though, the Friends show. I never I never watched that show. I know what it is, but. I just didn't watch TV that much. I still don't, right? I catch some shows. I'm trying to watch The Witcher show. I never played the game, so it doesn't make as much sense to me. It's an okay show, right? It's all right. Um, what's something else that I try to watch? Um, I'm trying to think, trying to think. The Expanse. Eh. I'm not much into sci-fi and space and all that stuff, but The Expanse has been okay. I still haven't watched this uh most recent episodes or whatever of this the most recent season i haven't watched any episodes of that uh i don't think anything else it was that i watched that i thought was pretty good now you gotta read the book to get the benefit from drinking the coffee that's what i meant to say Saiten, what's up zombies are smart enough to dig uh john you gotta be careful with uh you gotta be careful with that Oh boy, there we go again. There we go again. You doggone. Yeah, gotta hide you from the channel. I think they're just doing it to make me hide them from the channel now. The boys season three in near future. Uh, what is it that I was waiting on to come out that's coming back here soon? There's a show that 
Oh, Yellowstone. The missus and I started watching Yellowstone. It takes us forever to make it through a season, though, of a show because we only get to watch like one episode a week or something like that. But um, that's not it, though. There was something else that's coming out. And I was like, oh, yeah, that comes out this month. I can't think of what it is, though. All right, so we got four minutes left. I'm just scooping it up, folks, because I don't want to have to come back over here and mine again for a long time, all right? I'm scooping up what I can while I got the uh, the buzz from the thing. And here comes a screamer. All right, this is going to get interesting. We got a screamer. Just scream, coming down into my hole. Oh, she screamed again. Oh, you just keep on screaming if you want to, lady. I'll keep on knocking them down. Come on. Get on up in here. I got mining to do, woman. I can't be stopping for your every yelling and dog on it. Cobra Kai. Uh, yeah, maybe that's it. Uh, the missus and I are watching that too. And that's a pretty good little show, right? I never saw all the karate kids or anything like that in the movies, but the show is okay. I think there are a bunch of those karate kid movies back in the day. Really? Well, we might have to move locations, folks. Looks like it's getting out of hand over here. Ugh. We got a pretty good amount of mining in, though. I think I got four stacks of iron. Uh, three stacks of iron. Wait, right? Three, four. Oh! I will crack you on the doggone head. Lady Misty, don't you do it, Misty. You know you don't want to. They got me backed in a corner here, folks. Misty, Misty, I was nice to you. Oh. What, they're just pouring up in here. Oh my, woo, there's a lot of zombies, folks. I don't know, I don't know. We gotta heal up here. Man, they are just, this is like Horde Night all over again. All right, come on, soldier. Come on, soldier. Get over here quick, 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 quick. Don't you get hung up. There he is. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Ah. <laughs> hey! Go on it. There's no rip time happening. This is a doggone grand Spartan you're talking about. You get out of here with your little silly rips. I only got one hand here playing with, folks. This is child's play. There's no radiated spitting zombies or none of that stuff up in here. It's just that guy with no head and this lady laying on the ground like she's looking for contacts or something. Right, there was a loot sack over here. Oh, yeah, some money, some beef stuff. Oh, I got a little something wrong with my hand, though. That doesn't look good. It's only for nine more minutes. Well, they keep just giving me that, don't they? The, uh, whatchamacallits? Okay. Well... Yeah, yeah, Daryl, I took that extra stack of ammo just in case something like that were to happen, and it did. And, uh, well, we survived, right? We survived, except for Edgar. Okay. We need a little bit more stone, folks. A little bit more stone. 
Let's do a test. Only a test. If this were a real emergency, let's see what our buffs are. Uh, rot buster seven seconds. Okay, we're going to wait. We're going to see if uh, coffee still only works on iron, nitrate, lead, and coal. Or if it actually works on stone. So let me find a full block. This is a full block. We got 110 stone from that full block. I'm going to drink a coffee. I think it's only going to work on nodes. I don't think it's going to work on stone. 115. Okay, so you do get a little teeny bit more. Even stone. So they changed that from the last alpha. You think crouching during mining uh, reduces the heat map? Because it certainly doesn't reduce the sound, right? It's not like other tools that where it reduces the sound. It doesn't reduce the sound on it. Oh, you're telling the Zeds to rip. Yeah, that's all right. I see. I see. Good call there. Good call on that. United States of Terra was better show than I expected, Quip. I had never heard of that one, Quip. Look, Jay Hunter, what up? Yeah, the XP delivery system right there. It's good time. Vilo and the Doom music kicks in. <laughs> For the zombies, right? They're all playing that in their earbuds. They're coming in this hole with me. Not but one person coming out of this hole. And it don't start with Z. Just started watching Dexter Bell. Uh, that's a long show. Uh, I saw that there were a lot of seasons of that. And I tell you what, um, the Mrs. and I, there were two shows we watched, and I can't think of the one. But uh, the other one was Sleepy Hollow. And the first season was pretty good. We enjoyed it, right? Little, you know, not childish is not the word, but it was just, you know, it was a good show. It was a good show. But then the second season was really the same thing as the first season. There wasn't much difference there. It was like, it was like they finished this show too soon and it was more popular than they thought it would be. So they just kept on with it. But it was like after you watched the first season, every season after that was going to be the same thing. You know, I, and I, I don't know how to describe that in better words because it's been a while since we watched it. But we made it about halfway through that second season and I'm like, nope, like this is just like watching the first season over again, but you know, maybe not even as good because it's not new to us and I don't know. Never watched that, Brent. Never saw that one. Feral sense makes mining interesting. <laughs> I mean, they still, the booger ladies are going to come to you. Oh, someone asked me the other day, where does the booger lady come from? That's where the booger lady comes from right there, folks. I told a story about the mini, and she was on the uh, playground one day, and she talked about she and her friends were playing a game called Booger Lady. I was like, Booger Lady? Like, yeah, you know, we're just all playing, and we don't know where she's going to come from. And all of a sudden, she pops out, and it's like, you know, she's the booger lady, and if she gets you, then you're, you're out. You're done. And uh, she's like, when you see her, you got to yell, Booger Lady. You got to yell it just like that. So I was like, oh, okay. So that's kind of like the screamers on Seven Days to Die. She's like, yeah, yeah, just like that. <laughs> so I was like, hey, say that into the microphone for me. I could use that. 26, t 26 Toe, Band of Brothers. Uh, is that a show or a movie? I saw the movie, but I didn't know if there was a show, Band of Brothers. I'm just getting some clay to mix up with the uh, iron and, you know, some of that stuff. And we don't have any lead to smelt for bullet tips, but uh, I really won't worry about that too much right now. We can always come back and get lead. Right now, I want to get back over to the base and get some building done tonight. I really got to get the, the footprint laid out for this base that we're... Uh, we're working on over there. 
What are we looking like here for resources? We don't even have a stack of clay. Can you believe that? All that mining and not one stack of clay yet. That's crazy how long it takes to mine clay. I need the uh, dirt digger mod on here, the grave digger mod. Make it a whole lot faster. Bob is a series. Bob is a sap sucker and he's here in chat right now. He was. Father Goose, what's up? Not yet, Robert. I'm, I want to do that now, today. Right? But I'm out of resources. I had no resources at that new base. I was completely out. We smelted up and used every single resource I have. There's going to be a pretty massive cave in here in a moment, and I just hope that we don't die. Oh, uh, it's an HBO series, Band of Brothers? Okay. I saw the movie Band of... Was there a movie Band of Brothers? Or am I just losing my mind? I'm probably just losing my mind. No, I wasn't saving Private Ryan. Uh, it had the guy from the, the Friends show in it. And the guy that played in Billions, Axelrod, he was in it. Axelrod was in it, and, uh, and, and the guy from Friends, the kind of goofy guy from Friends that really didn't fit the part of a hardcore military guy in that movie, but well, whatever. Bob? Bob is no longer with us. Okay, maybe that's a... Um... Yeah, so that... That happens. Sometimes. At least he's not a bored old fart. A B-O-F. He's a buff. <laughs> What's up, man? Neon? Uh, I'll just tell you real quick, Neon. I got an 8700K. This is all pretty old stuff, right? Can't afford the new stuff, and it's hard to find... 8700K overclocked to five point something another, uh, 32 gigs of RAM, a 2080 Ti. The capture rig is a 9900K overclocked to like 5264 gigs of RAM. Don't even need a graphics card in there. I got a 1660 Ti in it just to produce the, you know, so I can see what's going on, but I uh, really don't need a graphics card and a capture computer. Uh, I got some stuff to sell to you, ma'am. I got some gold. I got some cash. I'll throw it at you one dollar at a time if you like. Got an auger. You're gonna like that, don't you? you? Like that? Got taters? What? Corn? That stuff's kind of hard to come by now. And there's an extra forge for 1950, but we can make that for cheap. First aid kit. I'll buy it. Um, uh, anything else? Steel is not worth buying. Chemistry station. That's kind of worth buying now because it beakers. Right, because beakers is why. Uh, anything else? So there's a beaker right there. I think I have enough beakers to make another chem station back at the base, though. We'll pass on that. And I'll catch up with your chat here in just a moment. If you give me just one minute here. Uh, we don't want the spear book. The spearmint book. There's crucible right there for sale. And the fireman's book. I don't think we want that. Blade traps, we kind of want those. But I could make those... I hate to spend money on something that I could just make, you know, but it saves the time, it saves the resources. Uh, okay, so I did that. Yeah, that now let's check out her tier four Press. stash and see what I'm she has doctor. in there. Mean saw. Batter up. All right, because we might switch to batter up or uh, clubs Remember at some me point. If you need medical supplies. Anything? No. You haven't found one yet in uh, Alpha 2080 beakers? Well, I think I have enough for one or two more chem stations. I, I think. Um, all the traders should have restocked. Boy, there's so many traders and places around the world we've never been to. But on the way back up to our home, because it's right here. Let's just swing by here real fast and uh, and see what that trader has to offer. That's perfect timing. 12 seconds left on the broken hand, sprain, whatever that is. Bird, what's up? Bird, you're probably going to have to Google that. Um, you know, I don't know. I think it's not until 7 Days is fully released on PC that they're going to go mess with the console. So you're probably looking at a year or two, right? You have to go to the Fun Pimps forum or, or Google it, and I'm sure there's plenty of... Uh, yeah, acid too, gerbil, but in my case, I have the book to get acid, so it's not 
so hard. I also buy acid anytime I see it at a trader. Oh, you're off till Sunday. Logan, nice. Don't forget, folks, I'll be live tomorrow and Friday on Christmas Eve. I'll be live. Uh, it'll probably be a little earlier, maybe five-ish on Christmas Eve. If I get back here in time. Uh, Holy, what's up? You got a beacon from an airdrop? Yeah, there you go. There you go. You get them from there. But, uh, but yeah, I'll definitely be live tomorrow as a normally, uh, you know, normal day for streaming for me. It's Thursday, but, uh, Friday I was going to take off because we're doing some family things for Christmas Eve. But then, uh, I found out last night that it's going to be a little later when we get started. So the loot and airdrops, it's pretty good. It's especially in the wasteland. But it's different than it used to be. You get these little packages. I like say it's a food package. There might be 10 meat stew in that food package. Or if it's a, it could be a melee mod package. So you're going to get some mods for your bat or your hammer. You know, it's just different stuff. But it's good. It's good. I like the way they did the airdrops now. Yeah. You got the book too. You keep using it to make tires. Well, you should never need but uh, five tires, right? Um... You get a bicycle for free, so you use two for a motorcycle and three for a gyrocopter, and you're done. And you may not need a gyrocopter like I did. My terrain was awful, having to go back and forth. I got tired of that, so I just made one. But, uh, you know, you, you should only ever have to really craft five tires in your entire existence in seven days. Unless you just want to collect all the stuff. I don't like the 4x4. Four four. It gets... It gets hung up on things. <laughs> what I was, I was not paying attention to what I was doing. And I could just skeet in and out on the uh, the old motorcycle, you know. And this is just for getting point A to point B quickly uh, without having to manage the terrain. Yeah, you'll want to start over. What's up, my Shadow Runner? You'll want to start over if you are uh, coming from Alpha 19. And you'll want it. Look at that, potatoes. You'll want to delete your percent. All right, look. Let me type it in chat for you. You go to that folder in Windows, Sham Chata. You delete every all the contents in that folder. And uh, boy, that's expensive for a repair kit. And then you do a fresh install. Got a sniper book. I think I only need a couple more of those. A little SMG turret. Tempted to buy that. I don't know if I can make that or not. Uh, automatic weapons handbook. I'll buy that. Alright, so now we're going to put the glasses on to get us to tier 5 and see what he has there. The great heist, I don't do I do not do those. I, those feel like a weight. Those are like PvP or something. Ranger's Guide to Archery, I'll buy that. Grave Digger, I have some. Chili Dog, I'll never make it. I think that's everything. It's been a real place. You watch yourself out there. Yeah, we don't have the full series, but the robotics. You know, I think it's because they want you to use the robotic now more than they did before. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, Lazale. Well, you don't need that much storage, though. Like, I rarely use this storage. Look at all that storage in this thing. I rarely, rarely use storage in any vehicle, mini bike, bicycle, whatever it is I have. Um, I'm very selective about what I take for loot. And I never go wanting, right? I always have everything I need. But uh, but I'm very careful about that because that's time. It's time management. Inventory management is time management, and you're going to run out of time to do everything you need to do if you're taking every little piece and, and part, you know. And uh, if you're not having to worry about the hordes or whatever, if you turn those off, or if you're just camping out in some POI every night for a horde night, maybe it's not a big deal, but I like to try to be prepared for it as prepared as I possibly can. So I don't take a lot of stuff with me. So I don't need all that kind of storage. Plus, you got a drone. A drone will follow you around now, and I think it has as much as the 4x4 if you mod it. All right. Take care, Natasha. Thank you. I'll see you tomorrow night, ma'am. You went for lunch, and now you're, now you're back. It must have been lunch, but it's over now. It must have been good, but I ate it somehow. Sarah, 
Lunch, Sarah. Wait. It's 8 o'clock here, Sarah. I thought you were in the... In the UK somewhere or something like that. So you don't... It, well, lunch? Are you in Australia, Sarah? Doggone it. Salak NJ, how you doing? Thomas Joseph? Welcome. There's Bob. What about Bob? Scheme Echo. What's up? Helps me to crash more often, Bob? When's the last time you saw me crash, Bob? When's the last time you saw that? You can't even answer that question, can you? are like, uh, oh, mmm. <laughs> All gone it, Bob. All gone it, Bob. Wait, is this my base? Oh, yeah, this is my base. Okay. Watch me come in for this feather landing right here. I mean, you ain't going to get no better than this. Watch this. Watch this. Oh, yeah. He's coming down. I'm going to ease it down. I'm going to ease it down. And so, let's bro. We're going to do a little spin move on you. Look at that. I guess I could go in through this way. I saw the zombie and kind of panicked. They're two soldiers. Oh, that must have been a soldier horde. Well, I bet there's some good loot you could get from that, right? Let's see if we can chop them up with the blade. But you can run over them. Oh, that's not good, though. I was going to see if my blade would chop them in two, you know, chop their heads off or something. But I don't think it does. I don't think it works that way. Can you do that? Or did I just miss them? Can you chop their heads with the blade? I tried, but nothing happened. It just knocked them over. Dorado, what's up? Um, sing some Christmas tunes? Well, I think last Christmas we did, right? Uh, I did some, I uh, played the piano and sang some uh, Christmas songs for you. You know, Santa Claus is coming to town. Stuff like that, but I don't know. I don't think a lot of people enjoyed it. Had a lot of thumbs down. <laughs> Maybe the music was no good. He knows when you've been sleeping. He knows when you're awake. <laughs> thumbs down. Get out of here. I ain't come here to hear no man sing no songs about no Santa Claus. Just play the game, man. That's what I get. That's what I get. All right, we don't need the coffee, the rock busters, the sham chata. Gonna do a sort. And, oh, I need to get the chainsaw, and I need to go cut some trees down. Look at that. I got a good chainsaw, too. Good, good. We're just going to stick some silly mods on there to increase the damage. Let's see. Modify that, this, and that'll work. I need to put that one on the auger for when we're going to get the clay. Okay, let's get some stuff a-smelting. This has a crucible in it. 6,000, take that out. We're putting 12K up in there. Uh, Thor? Mr. Lance, what's up? Hey, I upgraded from a level one bone shift to level six hunting knife. <laughs> Old guy hates Christmas. Oh, Jeffrey. Let's see. Okay. Have yourself a merry little Christmas, right? Do, 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 do. That's not enough wood. There were a lot of doo doos in there, too. Um, that's enough for that one. This is probably enough right there. That's 12K, right? Man, I don't know how much more we're going to need. Uh, let's just stack that right there like so. And brass? Uh, we're not going to really use that. You know, we're not going to really use that. I can make another crucible, and I probably need to. We need to put uh, something on this box so I know what's in it, because I keep getting confused and going to the other one. This is smelty. All right. Let's get this thing going. I want to do a little bit of building here. A little tiny bit of building. Not much. Some. Little. Let's chop down these trees over here. Get the lumber. John, what's up?
Uh, I got a lot of songs on SoundCloud, but um, they're not public. They're all private, and I use most of them for stream intros and a horde attacks, horde bases, and stuff like that. I play them at the beginning of every stream, but most of you never hear them, right? Because you don't come in at the very beginning of the stream. So uh, why don't I do that while um, while we're playing, uh, while we're cutting these trees down? I'll play a little uh, Grand Spartan original for you here. This is just the first one I've got on the list, so we'll go with that. Free Taco, what's up? Take care, Flack. Hope you're feeling better, sir. Figured I could get more wood with the axe, but... I want all these trees gone. All of them gone. Boy, the music's kind of loud, isn't it? I should probably turn that down. It's no louder than the chainsaw. A bear? Wait, what? It sounds squishy. Turn that back a little bit. Yeah, this is not how my chainsaw sounds at the Grand Outdoors. Not like that. That's a shameless plug for the Grand Outdoors. My other channel, which is right here. In the chat. Yeah, my chainsaw doesn't sound like that when I chop trees, though. Yeah. Almost done. Oh, it sounds like your dog's chew toy. That's not like jamming out some twos while you're chopping down some trees, right? We gotta get these things going anyway. They're just trashing up the place. And I need the wood. Sweet, as soon as I can get it to you, man. I, I can't really give you a date. Um, but hopefully soon. I'll get a new video up there soon. Just been so totally hectic and busy lately. I, I don't share a lot of you what goes on in my life, right? But I got a lot of stuff going on right now. Right, we're going to kill that. Um, maybe I'll leave you with some uh, something. I don't know. Vocal. That kind of sounds realistic right there. But the actual chopping of the trees is awful. Right, it does not sound like that. I just got through cutting some trees up at the uh, at the farm yesterday. I had the excavator out, you know, pulling up trees, and I had to cut them up into manageable pieces. And it does not sound like that. <laughs> All right, let's let's assess this. Where do we want our horde base? The trader is that way. We don't want to build that way. I think we want to build this way. We're gonna to want to build this way. The trees respawn. They do not. You have to plant more. You have to plant more. Um, okay. How can we do this to make a nice little platform so that it doesn't collapse? One, two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. If we went one, two, three, four, five, and then one, two, three, four, five, the wall could be the second support. I think that's how I'm going to play it. I think that's how I'm going to do it. You know what I mean? Like that? That'll be our support. Uh, that's one, two, three, four, five, and we're on six. You know what I mean? Something like that. And then the wall. You 
can serve as the next support for this bridge that will lead to our horde base. This could also be a way in and out. It's just cutting the trees that's weird. Yeah, right, right. Trust blocks builds out 10 blocks. I did a test on that in my test world. I I don't know. I'm going to have to test all that out more because that trussing is not like what you think it would be. So if I attach cobblestone to it, the cobblestone would hold as many out as the trussing would. Like... If you do that, it's the same no matter how you shake it with the trussing, right? So I... I don't know. Uh, it's, it's not... I don't know. I'm just going to have to do some more testing with it. It looks cool, but I can make the same trussing. Look at this. Trussing. Oh, wait. You can't with the cobblestone. How did I do it with... Maybe it's just cement blocks I was able to do it with. Yeah, whatever. All right. Kind of want to make this five wide so I can actually have a decent looking hallway leading over here. You know what I mean, DTAC? Not many people use the spikes, the tree. You missed your tree farms. Yeah, there's not as much a need for wood. I mean, but look, all those trees I cut down, all those trees I just cut down, I didn't even get a full stack of wood. And I think I had about uh, 500,000 or something in my inventory already. So, yeah, you don't get a whole lot. So, uh, one, two, three, four, five. You know what I mean? I messed that up. This goes here. But that's why we have this tool for boo boos. Camille. Yeah, 13 concrete blocks. That's right. Each way. Each way. We should be able to just build this out like that. Well, I'm excited for tomorrow's stream to get to working on this and actually putting together a horde. Wouldn't it be awesome if I get a horde base put together by the day 35 horde? I really don't know if we will, if we'll be able to, but it'd be cool if I could. So right here, we need a drawbridge somewhere. Uh, reinforced drawbridge. Are there any other bridges like this that I could use for like an attachment to our horde base that separates the horde base from the actual base? What was that? Oh, it was a screamer. Screamer down. Peter wants to join my stream? No. A reinforced drawbridge. A hundred, a hundred forged iron for that thing? I bet it takes like an hour to make that too. Is there no other bridge or anything? I thought there were more bridges in this. Yeah, mature is at 1,200. A lot of them were not. Uh, let's just make some for. I have no forged iron. I have very little forged iron. 182. I mean, that's just the bridge right there is all that is. Garage doors as temp floors. Chaos. Maybe that's what I'm thinking about. The rolling garage door. The steel garage door. Oh, that's what we ought to make. The steel garage door or the rolling garage door and put it down flat. You know what I mean? Spring. Let's just test it with this one first. Spring mechanical forged iron. Spring mechanical forged iron. Oh, I got to make it's five by three or three by two for that. Or this is five by three. Five by three, five by three, five by three. Maybe, maybe I can make that work. What's up, uh, Hank Jacobson? Thank you for subscribing and welcome. Ten, ten minutes. The game will be over in ten minutes. That's so long to make that. And then if it doesn't work, and I have to throw it out or scrap it or auger it down, I just wasted ten minutes and all those resources. 
Like a bridge over troubled waters, Bob. Logan, lay me down. <laughs> hey, what did I do there? I think I just took that in my inventory. Voice only a mother could love. Mama. That there. The roller door not advance rotate. The roller door doesn't advance rotate, Pale Rider? What? Cancel. Oh man. So we'll have we'll have no choice but to go five wide on this and make it into a uh make a drawbridge. That's the only way we can do it then. If we want to connect the other base to this base without the zombies being able to, you know, that's how we're gonna have to do it. Doggone it. All right. Draw bridge. Just crap. 18 minutes? Oh, man. That's such a long time. How many points am I sitting on here? I currently have six available, and I don't know where I want to go with them. I don't know where I want to go with these. I Strength? I mean, you know, not really. Perception? I'm Captain Intellect. I can't go any higher than that. I, I don't know. We'll have to think about that. Jeffrey? Yeah, that's true, Jeffrey. Um, Hubcap Mines? You got that. A pressure plate mine, cooking pot mine, tin, air filter, hubcap. You got all of those that you could use. Many fake floors with them. I think it is scheme. I, I I don't know if it. Yeah, it's gotta be. It's gotta be. It, it said five by three, didn't it? Where it doesn't it doesn't not say. Draw, but it doesn't say. I thought it was an even number. Isn't it four by something or another? If it's four by something or another, I don't think I'm gonna use it. I don't know. I don't know. I'll have to really think about that. I'd love to get the paintbrush. Uh, we're going to have to go to the forest biome. Uh, Cavalier Cat, what's up? Thank you. Welcome. But we're going to have to go to the forest biome and get a bunch of chrysanthemums so we can make uh, paint. We're going to garden grow in. Someone asked earlier, how does the garden grow underground? Just got to have this. A block of light. You can go back on uh, stream a couple streams ago and watch me build it to know how I did that. You could do an 11 by 11 underground. And, um, you know, you, you could do it that way and it'll work just fine. We got so much. Bad Bri, you're right. Run and gun would be fun. Dunn, what's up? None of the above matters. Used to play Rust. I got over a thousand hours in Rust. But I don't play it anymore. Okay. I kind of don't want to start on the Horde base until that drawbridge is done. And we see where we can go from here to attach it that's the most important part we got to find out how we're going to attach that to all right we'll just we'll do this this is an easy way in and an easy way out for now for now we can change this later but for now this is the way we're getting in and out i want to get a better way to do it uh, to come in and out i, I don't know you're thinking oh my bob what's up vlad There it is. If I step on that uh, without a motion sensor triggering it, it's it's going to be a bad day for all of us, especially me. But I did this for a reason. With Feral Sense on, it's been pretty calm out here, right? There haven't been a lot of things coming at me, even with Feral Sense. Maybe because we cleared it all, but you don't see a lot of zombies out here. But the Screamers, it's going to prevent them from walking in here. And then... Uh, any feral sense, wandering hordes, any of that stuff that walks in is going to get got. I used to, none of the above. I used to make some really, really cool bases in Rust. That was uh, was a fun thing for me to do. Of course, if you don't know, Rust is a PvP game. And, uh, and I did enjoy my time on it, but... Yeah, I haven't played that in two years or something like that. 
Well, this has got me a little uh, flustered now. I really want to build the horde base, but I want it to look nice when I attach to it. And currently, we don't know how it's going to look and how I'm going to attach to it. So, we're going to have to wait. But we got so much concrete mix. We're going to we're gonna build a horde base tomorrow night. We're building the horde base. No questions asked. That horde base is, uh, is getting built. Because we got this, we got uh, over a thousand concrete blocks and all of this concrete mix. I think I have another blade trap somewhere. Yes, there it is right there. So I have all the blade traps that I want for it. Uh, dart traps, I make a couple more of those were good. Fence posts were almost good. Got some switches here, right? Our horde base is almost the end game horde base is almost ready to be crafted uh, or built and uh, all installed. But oil shale. Oil shale, oil shale. Does anybody know if I have some oil shale? Oh, I do. Let's just use half of it. I might need the rest of it for oil cans. I don't know. Stacks of gas cans. Look at that. We don't need that much wood in there. It looks like ants running around. That's because it's uh, it was raining, maybe, right? Caitlin, how are you doing? Yes, I'm doing a stun lock, Caitlin. Exactly right. I'm going to attach the stun lock to this base. And then we'll, uh, you know, we'll have something that we can always go over to for Horde Night and get the maximum amount of experience and loot sacks for every horde instead of kind of roughing it in that barn, which is only going to survive another night anyway. Well, folks, uh, we're stopping right there for this evening. When I come back tomorrow... Um, we're going to go over there and get some stuff so we can start painting this thing and make it look like an actual bunker. And, uh, I also want to do something with the center right here. I thought about it today and I want to make another entrance for that also. And, uh, we're going to be building on the horde base tomorrow once that talk on drawbridge finishes up. But folks, thank you so much for hanging out here this evening. Thank you for your support. Thank you for all the thumbs up for all the donations. Stay safe out there. Have a wonderful Thursday. I'll be live between 6 and 7 p.m. Eastern time tomorrow. Stunlock base is right there. A uh, link into this uh, in the description too, probably. But there's a link in chat right there for the stunlock if you want to check that out. Scheme. But uh, but thank you, folks. Thank you so much for hanging out here. Enjoy your day tomorrow. I got Christmas Eve right around the corner on Friday. I'll be streaming Friday also, so Thursday and Friday streams. But. Uh, but take care, everyone. I'll see you tomorrow at 7.